Hey, this is Florian, OnlineTennisInstruction.com. In today's video, I want to show you what I believe is one of the best service motions on the tour. And this is Feliciano Lopez from Spain. He's currently ranked number 14 in the world. Feliciano has an excellent service motion. His serve is certainly his best shot, and uh, this has allowed him to be very successful on the tour since the year 2000. So in today's video I want to take a look at a couple of key body positions that he gets into that are also very important for your own serve. Okay, so the first thing to look at is how fluid his motion is. There's absolutely no stop in his motion, no stopping in the so-called trophy pose, which is a common problem. He has a very low toss, as you can see right here, and that makes it quite easy to have a fluid motion without a stop. So let's take a look at the toss height here from the front angle. So here in a second we'll see the highest point, which is about here as you can see with the green arrow. And from here the ball is going to drop just a little bit to contact. Okay, You can see the difference right here. Now this kind of a low toss is in my opinion the easiest way to develop a fluid motion on your serve. The real key, however, is to match your toss height to your swing. So if you toss higher, you delay the backswing in a way that Pete Sampras did, for example, so that you can still have a fluid motion. Okay, let's take a look at another key body position that all the great servers have in common. Right here you can see that uh, Feliciano Lopez's back is pointing slightly to the net. He has turned away from the target. Now another way to look at this is the line of his shoulders. His shoulders are pointing approximately towards the net post here on the left side. Now of course if you are right handed this would be the other way around. So from here he continues his fluid motion and gets into the racket drop position right here. Now the racket drop is a crucial position on the serve and one that many club level players struggle with. The thing to look for here is how low the tip of his racket gets. And as you can see, approximately the tip of his racket is in line with his hips right here. Now my online students sent me a lot of videos of their surf to analyze and oftentimes the racket drop is the problem. Often I see that the racket uh, drop position is not even underneath shoulder level. Now how low you can actually get depends on two factors. Number one is technique and number two is shoulder flexibility. So Lopez is in a good position here, however the biggest servers in the game get even lower. Guys like Andy Roddick for example can get significantly lower because of a very flexible shoulder. Technique plays a big role however and from the videos that students sent me I can say that almost always that racket drop position can be improved significantly with better technique. Alright, so much for this video. Now take a quick look at how nasty that lefty serve can be from the ad court out wide when you have good technique. Thank you for watching this video. To watch all of our free videos make sure that you subscribe to our YouTube channel below.